Have you ever met someone and been just blown away by their wisdom, their courage, their self-confidence and humor? Well, we introduced you to a kid who is all of that and much more just last year. Indeed. Now 10-year-old cancer survivor Zachary Summerrow is facing another serious health challenge. But as West Jews Michelle Meredith reports, he's stepping right up again. Zachary, what is going on? I'm reading a book. Ten-year-old oh Zachary Summerow lets nothing get him reading? down. Yes, he's in the hospital again, but that familiar, beautiful oh, spirit oh, in his heart is beating and away. I'm the king of the world. When we last left Zachary in November, a foundation was building him a stellar playground set in his backyard. He was celebrating. He had a tumor the size of a grapefruit in his little body. But after surgery, radiation, chemo, and Zachary's sheer will, he beat cancer. Where do you get all this energy from? One word, ice cream. I'm the king of the world! The undisputed king of the world went on a cruise last month, had a blast, won $450 in a bingo game. But when he came home, it hit him. One day, sometime I just woke up in the middle of the night, and then my chest was hurting. Zachary has a tumor on his heart. And according to dad, the doctors believe it could be cancer. And since it's his heart, surgery, radiation, even a biopsy is very challenging. So the family wants to get Zachary into a clinical trial. Dad is working day and night. I'm torn to being just broken down and crying and just sobbing, but that's not gonna do anything for Zachary. So while Zachary is in control of the beautiful spirit in his heart, health-wise his heart has a different plan. But no worries, Zachary gave his heart new marching orders. You're gonna work right now and you're gonna work in the future and you're gonna work as long as I stand. And have no doubt, Zachary is still standing. In Orange County, Michelle Meredith, West 2 News. Zachary's dad tells us that the kind of clinical trial they're trying to get him involved in is immune therapy, and there are all sorts of organizations pitching in to help Zachary and his family through this journey, and for that, they are grateful.